We called this meeting because we have not been entirely forthcoming about the situation in this building. It seems there's been a mole man living under the building for some time now. So. It's been eating our pets and putting us, generally speaking, in harm's way. Well, someone should warn Mrs. Habershackle. The mole man ate Mrs. Habershackle earlier this evening. Questions? Oh, you guys are an inspiration. As you know, I run a home business out of my apartment. A brothel is more like it. It's not a brothel. Okay, a brothel is many prostitutes. Anyway. Easy bright lights that keep going on and off. And if I can't do what I do, then how are you going to get paid? On and off. So I would like two ceiling fans mounted horizontally. And on and off at all hours. What do you think is happening to everyone's pets? He's not the only pet to go missing from this broken down building. I don't know, they get fed up with living in this dump and they leave. You guys must really love animals. Yes, we really love animals. They're too cute to kill. Now, we guesstimate that the distance from the furnace to the bedrock level below is somewhere in the neighborhood of eight to like 35 feet. Are you guys high? Why wouldn't they like us? We're very likable. Bro, it's a You're about to die right now. Yes! I think we are. Oh. We've been calling it a mole man too. That's the same word we There's need. absolutely no other term that could possibly be applied. Dooby dooby doo.